Hey guys, Thrash Metal and Fun Riffs here. Um, I had a request uh, for a while now. Uh, the Helm of the Anti Lemon channel has been asking uh, how I make my tone, record my videos, and uh, so I just wanted to do a quick rig rundown um, filmed at the desk. Guitar here. So normally downstairs, I have this long cable with this janky set of adapters. Okay, so here's the my one pedal. It's a Boss ME70. And it has this preamp section, as it would be first, where you can, from that left knob, select it to different types of emulations rectifier, lead, stack, tweed, combo. Well, if you go all the way down, it sets to EQ just before off there. So if you're using the emulation mode, you're going to use those top settings. You get three bands of EQ with a gain plus treble and level. If you're using the EQ mode, you use those bottom settings and you get four bands of EQ, low, low, mid, high, mid, high, and level. Then we have some reverb on, the output level, the chain at the top. And you see I'm on my user preset, my user setting one. There's also presets, nine of them that would are uh, that will say P one two three four. This is where you select if your expression pedal is a. It's always volume, and then you when you kick it on, do you want it to be wah, octavizer, that stuff. And just below the display there, it says NS threshold. That's your noise noise gate where you can set your number for that that you like then this is basically four choices of effects you can have from delay and all these types of delay on the left that's where I would turn on my phrase loop if I wanted to use it it's where it's set to now Here's all your modulation type pedal choices, flangers, phasers, chorus, tremolo, vibrato, and the settings for those. So it's just like using individual pedals that you might be used to. This is the compressor effects and overdrive distortions. You see I have both of those on. I'm not using actually any modulation or delay in my normal like metal setting that I've been using. So basically got the compressor settings on the left. It's set to compressor, but that could be other types of effects. You see where the sustain and uh, attack and levels are set. Then I've got the the metal or the distortion. You have like a bunch of choices there and I've got it set to metal with the drive tone and levels. Okay, so right now, since I'm gonna record this one at the desk, it's uh, got the record out headphones, it's just a cable that goes behind the, the cupboard here. So this is a desk that I built like 10 years ago. And it's just got like junk in there, a gig bag, some yarn. And that goes back behind these two drawers to the PC tower plugged into a mic input behind well there's also an amp behind there and that amp allows the speakers here to switch from the normal surround sound to whatever's playing at my desk whether it's a guitar or my DAW YouTube etc so I've got the DAW open this is just a basic crystal media audio engine Crystal Audio Engine. 
got one track open set ready to record and it's set to the front mic input and right now the guitar when I turn it on it will play through the speakers so I can hit the volume panel up Fades or something. Like, I can see that is affecting the dog. So that's where I might set the level, and I could jam in the room along to the stereo and record at the same time all right so next i've got this uh janky lamp stand here that's kindly decorated with a Las Vegas painting and bones for Halloween. Okay, so next on how to make the world's cheapest internet video for YouTube cover. I'm just going to need to rehearse the song a few times, set the levels, make sure I can hear the stereo and the guitar, and uh, decide if I want to hit record or not. So I might play for a few minutes. Turn the song a few times, get warmed up. Okay, so next I want to um, let the stereo play and see how loud it's going to be. Okay, so now I've kind of got my levels set and tuned and ready. And um, remember, it's just playing through a, a little nothing amp, you know, so. So now I've hit record on the DAW and I'm just going to give it a shot and see if I can lay down a couple of tracks. <laughs> 